Okay. Um, we have got the 1.5 anniversary announcement. Your CDV war is behind me. We will be talking about it, but I more want to actually talk about um other features as well. Hopefully, I don't mind. I'm B Tactics. I want to give my opinion. Well, a little bit of opinion, but more just what's going on, right? So we're gonna be adding more cyberpunk, you know, futuristic features of the game. Now, the reason I'm not giving eye attack contact because I don't have this all memorized. I wrote it down, right? They're gonna be having like field energy collectors. I'm not really feeling it. The going around collecting the energy anymore. I get it. That's what the area is supposed to be. It's not fun. I hope we get out of this soon, right? The the cyberpunk futuristic parts where you can like run on walls and stuff. And maybe it's just me, but I hate the fact that I have to use an item to get it to work. It's time limited. And then like if, if you run out of time, you'll fall. It's not like when you're on the board, but I guess when you're on the board and you're moving around the water, you use stamina too. So I don't know. That's based on y'all. I just don't like it, right? They got the uh, the four symbol cauldron. It's kind of like how we recently had the um, world boss and we donated things to it. And you get some in-game, you use in-game materials to get rewards. Now, what are the rewards? I don't really know. I couldn't really tell, but looking at the stream. But, you know, I try to condense the 17 minutes to like, you know, maybe 10 minutes most, right? They're gonna have um, two new world bosses. They have uh, Phelan. It's like a dragon. Um, it looked kind of like it looked kind of like Rudolph in a way. No horns. Instead, like these majestic wings. Um, and it doesn't look like mechanical at all. It looks like a pure mythical beast. Um, I guess the quick the thing you can re relate it to is like a Suicune from like Gen 2 of Pokemon. Um, but the other boss is um Ying Zhao. Ying Zhao is a mechanical um well it's a mecha, it's a mecha machine that can be fighting. It gets stronger the more we fight it. So that's good. That's cool. That means we... I mean... I don't want to say it's content. But it is content. It's something to look forward to. If you don't want to use anything, you just want to fight something and feel good about yourself, you can fight that. We're going to be having two new characters. Plotty and Yanuo. Yanuo is Brevi's bestie. I hope they kind of add a mechanic where you use Brevi's bestie on Yanuo's weapon. Or is there someone holding the weapon? There should be some form of passive on it. That'd be awesome. If not, it is what it is. I don't really have anything to say on Plotty. You heard enough for that. I don't really know the character. Um, but they're going to be having upgrades for this 1.5 anniversary. Which, you know, I'm happy. Like, I look at the picture. It looks like we get, like, quite a few amount of um, rewards. I don't want to go too heavy into it. But things that stood out to me that were new were a new form of upgrades. They're, like, yellowish. You got plenty of summons, it looks like. It looks like it was, like, maybe, like, 50. Um... Now, there's a reason. I, I hate the fact they put 50, even though 50 is better than zero. Why not 80? You know, every time we have an event, why not make it so someone can gather it and say, hey, I have 80 summons. I can have a chance of getting an SSR. Then you may fail. There's not a 100% chance. Um, Of course, I can say 120, but that's kind of, you know, I feel like that's pushing a little bit. Like, But, hey, that's me. But y'all want to say 120 is better? I'm not mad against it. Wow, I'm the player. I don't lose anything from it being 120. That's a business. That's a business decision, right? You get you get to choose like weapons from the SSRs, and the newest one you can choose a heart stream. I think that's bogus. This came out with um, Lyra and uh, Tian Long for that. So it's like, why weren't they included? I think that's you know, in my opinion, silly. Um, but yeah, those are things I noticed. Um, let's let's look more into um. Oh yeah, that the Mia skin. Um. Not too much in the main skin. They got the older vehicles returning, so that means we get potentially more dark crystals. Maybe you, maybe that to be purchased. Well, I hope they're not. I hope they're not purchased. I hope they're not all purchased. I hope some come back and say, "Oh, we can unlock it," or if we already have, we can choose a different one, or we can get dark crystals. You know, some something to get instead of just saying, "Oh, there's an event I could have gotten, but I can't get it." Right? Um, they got the um a new collab. I think it's called. I don't know how to pronounce this, so please forgive me. Evangelion? E Evangelion? I don't know. Um, it's a collab in the, within the first half of this year. It's going to have three characters. Asuka, Rei, and Shinji. I'm pretty sure Shinji's not a playable character. I'm pretty sure Shinji was the male. 
that's kind of awkward because again you're just showing Taiwan waifus but if that's what sells that's what sells I don't know why they couldn't add Shinji as just like a uh, as a simulacra like they did with one in the past if I got the, the woman's name because she has not been relevant since that one time but that's just me um I feel like Asuka and Rey may, may be you know cosmetics to other weapons that came out in the past I don't want to state the name, you know, because I don't want to get myself in potential trouble, right? Suppose they're going to be having their mechas show up too. Uh, EVA 00, EVA 01, and EVA 02. I don't know what they do. I, I don't know anything about this anime. I don't know much about anime. At least I'm being honest with you, right? They're going to have be having a vehicle too, which is cool. Am I going to buy it? Probably not because it's going to cost a lot of money. But hey, all, all is right in the world right now. They're going to be having a smart servant named Pen Pen. I don't know what element it is. I don't know what um, if they're going to have like, oh, I can gather from farther away. But again, I'm not mad at it. Shout out to them for trying to, you know, to monetize how they can. Hopefully, we can continue to make money for the game because hey, more money, you know, better business. Simple as that. But this is my confusion. I don't know how I feel about this classic server. Now, I wasn't sure if it was gonna, you know, be the same way. Um, Cause I'm confused when they stated that the global version is a balanced version of CN, but then, well, not, not the classic server, sorry. The, the reboot server. So if the reboot server supposed to be, um, the balanced version, why would you have a balanced version of the balanced version? You know, so if we have a reboot server, I don't I don't really understand what's going on here. I just feel like you're gonna be splitting the community up. Um and say, oh, it's what that smaller power creep. So we could use more weapons. And which again, I'm not against it. Question is why not just do that within the older weapons and make them stronger? I mean, granted, it might be some law there, maybe. But no one's gonna complain about numbers going up. They complain about numbers going down. And you can just like increase the percentages. That's it. Just increase the percentages. Keep the weapons exactly the same. Don't quote add damage. Quote fix the percentages. I don't see what's wrong with that. But since we're on the fact of fixing things, Meryl's passive still does not work properly. At one point when you get in the water, you can always get back up on your two feet and walk on water. Not with Meryl passive right now. Once you fall in the water, you're in the water. We need to fix that. But hey, I hope y'all enjoyed it. I'll try to keep this short as I could. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this potential update. Do you, are y'all excited for the 1.5 anniversary? Are you gonna try to get one of these new characters? I'll be honest, I think I may try to get A0 or both because I don't know if they'll ever be in the game and I don't think they'll ever be in the, uh, the permanent pool to say, hey, you can get this character. Now they may. I have to do my. I have to, you know, do some information on some other characters on CN. But until then, hey, y'all enjoy yourselves. Thank you for watching the video. Like and subscribing, because you can put that subscribe button right over here. And don't forget, you can watch the videos over here. I want to see you in there too. All right, you enjoy yourself.